Uh, I have a lot of respect for for all our ancestors, um, um, and uh, and coming to uh, to Israel was uh, was certainly, um, of course, wonderful. Um, but at the same time, it was also a difficult a difficult time for um, the transition from um, from where my ancestors grew up. Number one, I, I think it is the most important, one of the most important things that has happened for, um, for us. Um, it has given us an anchor uh, home um, in today's world. Um, and the creation of the state of Israel has given us the security to be able to um, have a place that uh, we can feel safe um, somewhat uh, compared to anywhere else in the world. And it's a place that unites us, and it's a place that um, you know brings us uh, together. And it's our home, and it's always been our home. And um, to have that um, legitimately placed on the world map today, and um, and you know have our flag, and um, to know that it's a place that we can go to, and it's a place I go to multiple times a year, even though Canada is still my home. I still we still travel there with the family a lot. Um, I think it's the best blessing we've had, and um, and I think it's it's paramount um, um, that the state of Israel is there. And at, at the jail, in every ten minutes, the policeman he look from the window and he crash on me. And I and I have a friend. He said, Joseph, doesn't matter if they split on you. If do we have Israel, that's it. We don't want anything else. Like I can stay in a prison for uh, for a long time. Doesn't matter for me. If we don't have Israel, we have nothing. We have Hashem, Corona, and Israel for the Jewish people. That's all we have. Without the land of Israel. We cannot survive the Jewish people. You know, you you want to do better, and you want to succeed, and you want to flourish, and um, um, you want to become uh, an important part of the community and, and, and give back to the community that has um, enabled us to have the safety, the security, and the life we have. Um, and we were able to live the life of what I remembered um, as a child before leaving Iran. Um, you know, the life that I remember in the good times as a child in Iran, and I still have memories of that. Um, and being able to live that now uh, with my family and having the safety and security of Canada and being able to be Jewish and be proud of it and not have uh, uh, any fear uh, or any repercussions from it in the same way that I would have in Iran. And um, that's been the, big, the biggest blessing. And, uh, and, uh, and I'm, I'm extremely grateful for it.